favorito. Hey, what's up, what's up, guys? It's your boy Sky Cobras again, and today, 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 we will be unboxing and reviewing the SH Figure Arts Jiren Normal Mode, so suppressed Jiren. All right, so we're gonna be unboxing him. As you can see, he's still in his brown box. So let's, let's get started right now. All right, I know someone's excited to see him open. <laughs> anyway, so this is the design of the your your usual. SH Figure Arts box, brown box, nothing special here. So let's open him up. Oh, I can feel so much energy in this box. <laughs> so slowly but surely, I'm opening all my figures. This is actually a new figure. I only got him like a month ago. So, but unlike the others who's been stuck here for years, he's actually lucky because he's gonna get opened faster than most so here he is let's just adjust the light here he is in all his glory this is the box oh my goodness that is a beautiful box art here where the figure is posing just like this one here. on the side here you can have you can see other pictures of him the figure here at the back you can see here super modeling you can see him posing with the super saiyan god super saiyan goku I, ha I have that too i'll be reviewing him in the future Your usual sh figure arts right up down here we have jiren again jiren shouting so let's get him open shall we okay there you go so much heat exhuming from this box He comes with four different right hands and four different left hands. This includes one of the right hands. And then he also comes with this flaming effect that you could equip. Uh, another hand for holding a hair, I didn't count that. Three heads and one interchangeable arm. This is for his arm specifically, for him to do his signature cross arm mode. So before the figure, these are hands first. So as you can see, zoom. These are your hands good detail on these hands he has these two um, be gone hands stop another power hands beam hands I think there you go there's a detail they're just gloves really but it's nice to see some wrinkling going on there a little bit of wrinkling a grasping hand there you go and one hand is glowing this would seem to be a reenactment of when he would do that flaming fist he would use on Goku or Vegeta when he says would say it's over also he comes with this hand it's good for the Super Saiyan God Super Saiyan Goku I do not have him open yet but when I do I will put this on that guy as soon as possible here is other head head sculpts this comes with a mad face shouting face and the stair face. This is where, uh, this is the face you want to use for the reenact when he would do that stare that would just suddenly punch people. Just the stare alone of Jiren is enough to just demolish his opponents. And probably my favorite, I think, of all the accessories is, are these hands, these cross hands. Now onto the figure itself. And as you can see, boy, oh boy. What an absolute unit Jiren is. So this is the figure. Oh my goodness. First squeaks. Wow, what a what a tank of a figure. Oh my gosh. They did such a good job of handling this figure. I'm just amazed. He's wider than I thought in person. Oh my goodness. Here is your boots. So not much going on there, just your standard white boots. Moving on to the arms. This is a tight bodysuit, so it shouldn't be that hard to sculpt him, just showed muscles. Not, not not really unlike the Goku where you have to put like folds into his glowy and not, not really for this one. Just mold it to his body according because it just stretches to his size. Wow. Here's more detail. Good matte finish. Everything. Muscles looking good. And the face. 
who saw the other faces, but this is his other face. This is a standard face. He is not amused. Beautiful, beautiful. Look at the detail, man. Look at that back. Wow. Spread throughout. Latasaurus Rex, this guy. Everything about him, bro. Just wow. Jiren stands at about, I'd say, 6.8 inches. You know, almost nearing that 7 inch mark. You know, that, that, that's NECA territory at that point. Let's go with articulation with this bad boy. Okay, so starting from the head, you can look this much down, this much up. There's also rotation here. Then you can go from here to here. You have your neck articulation, traps, nope, they don't move. Your standard butterfly joint. Now with the butterfly joint, I believe you can, let's see. You can do the cross arms, thanks to the butterfly joint. But it's not as, let's, let's gonna try, let's try. Oh, I see, so I don't think you can, I mean you can, this is, Ah, no, not really. Maybe that's why they included this hand because his lats are just too big. Look at the stretch on his lats when you pull out the barf. Oh my goodness. Wow. <laughs> so there's butterfly joints here. Your standard for any high end toy. Then you have articulation here. You have a swivel. You can go up here. You can go all the way. Whoops. Then from here, you have your double jointed elbows. So you can get that flex. Just for you to see what absolute power really is. Um, for the gloves, the bottom of the gloves, no articulation. But for the hands, you can go here. You can twist it like that. For your ab crunch, there's, oh, there's good, oh wow, there's good range for his abs. Oh my, he can pop that chest out more I did not expect him to pop out that much so then you have until here so there's your range of motion for the abs oh my that that just looks awkward if, if you do I think this is like good for like uh, flying pose I suppose then you also have articulation here at the waist you can twist this here go sideways the legs can go this much only not really that flexible he can't do that much of a high kick you can go this much for a side kick and it can twist here there's a twist here more of just a twist down here you have your double jointed knees all right ballerina gym <laughs> and then you have your ankle pivot you can swing here left rear down and of course your toe joint so yeah this guy is looking jacked in details and in articulation. You can really play around with this guy. This is, for a big guy like him, he still has that good range of motion. So let's have some fun with this figure, shall we? Let's, let's pose him up. You know, the absolute strengths there. This head, over so gently. This is your peg. It's a lot more, it's a lot easier, I think, to switch out. So you can switch it like this. There you go. Oh wow. Ho ho ho. Oh yeah. Got him extending all the way up for that stair. Oh yes. Yes sir. So let's port this one in. Oh yes sir. Oh wow. Okay. So there we got that hand in and that face scope in. Let's pose him up. Where he gives you a good punch. Oh, wow, this is, I am just at awe. I, I rarely change the hands for my SH figures, but I think this is a figure where it's really fun to change up his hands. Oof, I would not like to get hit by that. Yikes, look at that. Ooh, absolute strength. Now, last, last. Oh, I'm having, I'm having such fun with his arms. Last but not least, let's take this, these hands, I'm guessing, port this out, there you go, 
You part this hand out. This is a signature, guys. This is a signature. Tight, 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 yeah! It was at this moment that he knew he fucked up. I remember a while ago I was trying to put these in and I don't know man, I should be watching you other YouTube reviews before I play with my toys because I got the common issue with this Jiren which is it snapped guys. No God please no 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 Oh my god <laughs> No you know what's sad? Let me just tell you a story, guys. I actually accidentally bought two of these. I, I wasn't aware I bought from another store. And then I ended up selling that one for a cheaper price. And now it looks like I was meant to have two because this first one, oh my goodness. It just, it popped off. The peg popped off. Let's check him out with other SH Figure Arts toys. This is SH Figure Arts Beerus. Your SH Figure Arts from MCU, the other line I collect in SH Hulk. Here he is scaling with other SH Figure Arts. Now let's see him scale with other toy lines. Here he is with Mezco Wolverine and Mayfex John Wick. And, and Mezco is known for having bulky looking figures, but just look at this Logan compared to the Jir. He just. Wow! That boy, thick boy. This boy, thick. Figma? One Punch Man, I think they resemble one another, don't you think? Bald Man, <laughs> with overwhelming strength. And then, Revel Tech, Amazing Yamaguchi, Spider Gwen, there. The Jason Voorhees with NECA, and the Disney Store, Disney Select, I don't know how you call it. Incredible Hulk, who still cannot fit in the frame. Get him there. So, yep, he's still big. He's still fairly big. I mean, look at him. He's still massive. But anyway, that just sucks, guys. Yeah. Damn, SHF. I thought I was the only one, but it seems to be pretty common with other Jirids from the community. And wow, it's just really takes away from my verdict. But my verdict for this figure is actually, you know what, still a 10 out of 10 because it's just unlucky that I got this type. Not everyone I saw from the toy community had a broken peg, but it, but it is, it's there, you know, the problem was there. Be careful with it. The tightness of the joints here is a problem. This one is actually very loose, easy to hold, but this one, oh, see that? This left side is just doomed, dude. It's just a curse. And then this one, oh my god. It can still pop in, so I guess it'll pose like this for a while. But yeah, this figure is definitely a 10 out of 10. It's a must-have. He's actually my favorite character from the Tournament of Power. I love this figure. I love this character. And yeah, this has been the unboxing and review of the SH Figure Arts Jiren. And as always, guys, it's been your boy Sky Cobras. And I'll see you again for the next toy review. Bye-bye.